we can't even begin to spell all the benefits it will have when we're in God's immediate presence in the new heavens and earth. It's, basically, it's found in Revelation 21, verses 3 to 5. And what it really is, is that, remember, Moses could not look upon the face of God and live. We will not just look upon the face of God, we will walk hand in hand with God. And it says here clearly, he will be our God, we will be his people. We will have this absolute physical proximity and awareness and fellowship and, and love. And we will, we will look upon the face of the God who created this, the heavens and the earth. We'll look on, on eternity. We will have all, the joy will be, I think it's a joy that can't even be described in human language. There's just no language to attest. And really, Revelation 21 is merely a human attempt to get at the glory and the joy and the incredible nature, the majesty that will be ours when we are with God in the new heavens and new earth. It's beyond, it's beyond compare. Uh, but it, primarily it will be, we will be in his absolute presence we will be eternal beings. All of the pain, all of the suffering, all the mourning, all the hurt will be gone forever. And the joy is something that I, I think that nothing can approximate the joy that we'll have at that time.